Hello and welcome to Diet Diaries, a Prime TV capsule designed to guide you towards leading a healthier, more fulfilling life. I'm Cheryl Afonso, and over the next couple of minutes, I'll be sharing with you answers to nutritional questions that have always boggled you and left you wondering about what's right. Well, as a new year rolls in, the question at the top of everybody's mind is, what do I do to lose the kilos I've piled on after the week of celebration excess? And the answer is simple. No, don't starve yourself. Just go back to where you stepped off on on the 24th of December. First things first, get back to your sleep-wake routine. Ensure that you get your suggested seven hours of uninterrupted sleep. Many fail to recognize that the fewer hours of sleep you get, the more difficult it is to make the right food choices. In your grogginess, you reach out for all the wrong foods and also end up eating more than your body requires. Second, ensure that you tank up on the recommended 3 liters of fluid every day. That's a 200 ml glass of water for every one of the hours that you are awake. Also remember that your 3 litre fluid recommendation includes only lime water, tender coconut water and your regular tap water. Tea, coffee, milk, juices and clear soups do not count towards your fluid intake. They are dehydrating liquids that cause increased micturation thereby increasing your body's need for fluid. Next, get your eating schedule in order. Breakfast within 45 minutes of waking up a snack three hours after breakfast, lunch three hours after your snack and another snack three and a half hours after lunch and dinner not later than 9 p.m. Don't forget to stay up moving around for at least two hours post dinner to enable adequate digestion and a restful night. Breakfast can include carbohydrate protein combination foods such as breakfast cereals with milk, idlis, dosas, chapatis and pulse, egg and toast and the traditional options such as poha, upma and sabudana khichdi. Meals should include a good blend of vegetables, protein in the form of dal, curds, fish or lean meat, salads and a smaller portion of rice or bread. Snacks should be light and can include fruits, nuts, fresh juices, raw vegetables and milkshakes. What quantities should you be eating at each meal? Well, that depends on your body weight. But do make sure that eat slowly and chew each morsel of food very, very well. Spend at least 10 minutes savouring each meal instead of hurriedly swallowing the food on your plate. Ensuring that you eat every 3 hours will help you choose smaller food portions whilst also allowing for adequate digestion and an increased metabolism that will help you keep your weight under control. Well, that's your diet tip for today. If you have any queries related to the subject of food, diet and nutrition or comments that you wish to share with us, please email us at the address you see scrolling below and we'll be more than happy to address your questions on our upcoming episodes. Eat right, stay healthy with us on Prime. So what exactly are calories and how do I determine whether I'm consuming the right amount of calories?